What are the primary value drivers in an LBO model? It's a popular private equity interview question and the reason I created this template, which excludes interest expense, and that really set people off in the comments. So let's make some updates. Let's start with a 7.5% blended interest rate. We can use the average function to calculate it for each year, and we can update the balance sheet calcs to reflect the change. Before I make this update, notice that we have an MOIC of two times. Interest expense drops us to an MOIC of approximately 1.8 times. So each value driver needs to push us over two times to make up for it. To keep the math the same, you're gonna have to live with a negative cash balance because the math was precise last time. First value driver is entry multiple. Drop it to nine and we're back above two. If you increase debt, we're over two again. Increase cash flow through the roof. Increase your exit multiple and again, still doing better. So the primary value drivers are purchase price, capitalization, cash flow, and your exit multiple. And yes, interest expense is included in capitalization, but the point of the exercise is to try and illustrate what moves the needle the most. Here are the other changes people wanted to see. A larger transaction, a lower debt profile, and a less aggressive amortization schedule. Try not to get too hung up on inputs. You can make an Excel template do anything. It's not real life. But hopefully these exercises help with foundational knowledge. All right, team. Thanks for watching.